ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಹರಿಹರ್ ಮೂರ್ತಿ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಎನ್ ಇ ಟಿ ಸ್ಪೆಷಲಿಸ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟಿಸಿಂಗ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಲೋರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ತ್ರೀ ಡಿಕೇಟ್ಸ್ ನಾವು ರಿಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ವ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಇಯರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ನೀಡ್ಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಡನ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಬೈ ಪ್ರೊಫೆಷನಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಡನ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ರುಟೀನ್ ಎಟ್ ಹೋಮ್ ವಿತ್ ಬರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಎನಿ ಅದರ್ ಇಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೇಫ್ ಟು ಡೂ ಅ ಬ್ಲೈಂಡ್ ರಿಮೂವಲ್ ಆಫ್ ವ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಆಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕಾಸ್ ಇಂಜುರಿ ಟು ದ ಕೆನಾಲ್ ದ ಇಯರ್ ಡ್ರಮ್ etc it's essential to use the right implements if one is using curette to clean the wax the wax may be sitting usually in the front portion which means in the outer portion of the external auditory canal and when you use any instrument the instrument must go behind it to remove the wax it's not possible to use a bud because the bud will only further push it into the canal in fact there are more people who come with the impacted wax in the inner portion of the canal sometimes even injuring the ear drum as a result of which they have problems it's essential to use the right implements so do not try this at home go to a professional get it clean sometimes syringing is done syringing is using a jet of water or saline to go into the ear the flow of the jet is usually directed like this so that it goes inside goes behind the wax and after a returning from the tympanic membrane pushes the wax out that is the right way of doing the syringing the third thing sometimes people use a suction apparatus so using a vacuum is to put in a tube with a vacuum connection thereby the suction apparatus is used to suck out the wax it can happen when there is soft wax perhaps which is not coming out easily with the syringing but in a hard wax it is best not to remove it because the hard wax itself can cause abrasions and cause pain in the patient rarely wax has to be removed in the operating room under anesthesia very rarely nonetheless it is something that is to be kept in mind why the wax can go inside is only like i said by pushing it inside either by putting a finger in the ear and agitating the ear or using a bud to push it inside now this can push the wax inside if it was only that there is no problem but the dead skin that accumulates behind the wax in the inner part of the ear can have a pressure effect causing erosion of skin sometimes the bone as a result of which patient can have intense excruciating pain and this may require to be removed under anesthesia only because it's very painful to remove it without anesthesia so removal of the wax if it is not done properly can have very serious impact